This foundation is very beautiful. Like, I don't even want to take it off. I'm using black gel. Why I bought black gel? Girl, I'm still trying to figure it out. Please excuse my nails, you guys. I had a rough week, okay? As the Hodgin twin says, do whatever the F you want to do. So I'm just getting ready just to go out on a quick little date night. I did get a sample of the NARS um, Soft Matte Foundation. I got it in the shade Macau, which is medium deep four. I think this might be a little too dark for me, but we're gonna see. So this is the sample size that Sephora has given me, okay? It's a little, little itty bitty thing. It does look like it could be my shade, so we're gonna see. I think I'm applying way too much, to be honest. <laughs> but let's just see. Okay, this is turning out to be a lot more burgundy than I wanted it to be. I was hoping that this brown in the Huda Beauty palette would have been like a dark brown, you know? But it's more on the red side and the payoff is more red, which is not what I was going for. And I'm not wearing anything red tonight. So, and the lighting on here just doesn't really help me at all. Um, so, and this is just way too light, let me see. So, okay. And I don't want a pink in your tear duct color. So, um, let me match it on the other side, but I think I'm gonna try to go in with something gold. I think I might go with this one. Okay, I'm gonna go in with this palette. This is the Nika K palette, it's the Oh Honey. I'm gonna go in with this color right here. I 
It doesn't look bad, but it's not really what I wanted. Whatever. It is what it is. I'm going to line my lips now, and then I'm going to do all this mascara and all this kind of stuff, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So, I'm back. I'm going to do my lipstick, and then I'm going to apply my ponytail. Okay? So, yeah. As I said, I'm not overall satisfied with the look. It is what it is, whatever. I'll survive. So first things first, I'm gonna go with lip liner. I'm gonna go in with Toast by LA Girl. So that's the lip liner. And then for lip gloss, I'm just gonna go in with this by, I believe this is LA Girl too. I, I posted it in a haul, but this is in the shade Wink. And this is the lip. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with my ponytail. So guys, I'm just wearing a sweater dress. I got this sweater dress from H&M. It came in this tangerine color and it came in a beige color. I kind of regret not getting the beige, but I'm very happy that I got the tangerine because, yeah, I'm very happy about that, okay? So this is what it is. And I'm doing a low bun today. I did put in some bobby pins. I am gonna take the bobby pins out. So you guys, um, slick back your hair whatever way you want. I wanted, I wanted my hair to look like there was texture to it. So um, if you like your hair slicked back, slick it all back. But I like my hair to look like it's textured. So pretty much dried. Let me move back for you guys. Okay. Okay. Um, I feel like I need one more hair band, but I should be okay. I'm using black gel. Why I bought black gel? Girl, I'm still trying to figure it out. Still trying to figure out why I went ahead and got me black gel instead of getting clear. You know, these are the things that keep me up at night. <laughs> like the silly decisions I make. I'm just like, why would I? I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking in the moment, but it's okay. I'm still gonna use it either way, right? So anyways. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys my ponytail just because I didn't show it last time. Comb at the top, comb at the bottom. I'm gonna leave the seller um, I'm gonna leave the vendor that I bought this from in the description box for you guys if you guys are interested in picking it up. And make sure that your combs aren't stuck in between the cap so that you can properly, properly, you can properly get it in, okay? As the Hodgin twin says, do whatever the F you won't do. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Something in right here. And then, do you like that? Sorry. Take a take um, a piece of hair. As you take a piece of hair. You guys, I'm so excited. But anyways, um, I'm really excited just to go to this bar or this pub. It's not even a bar. I'm going to a pub. It's downtown. It's on College Street by. College of Bathers. So if you live in Toronto, you know what I'm talking about. It's down there, it's called the Bistro 22. Never been there, but they got cheap shots. They got shots for, I think, dollars. So that's why I'm going cute and cash because I'm gonna be wearing sneakers and stuff like that. And we're probably gonna be sitting outside because it's not too cold tonight. This is what it looks like. I don't feel like I put it in properly. But anyways, let me show you guys what it looks like so you guys can see. Did you guys see that? I hope you guys saw. <laughs> Going in with these earrings. I'm making sure the side is right because this side has makeup on it. <laughs> 
So don't ask me where I got these earrings because I got them a long time ago. Long time ago. Okay. And then this is what it is, you guys. Let's see if I can zoom out for you guys a little bit more. See, as I zoom out, it gets foggy, but y'all appreciate it anyway, right? So this is what it is. <laughs> This is what I'd be looking like. I could easily go with a different kind of lip color. I think I'm probably gonna lighten up the lip color just because the lip gloss, it's milking with the lip liner, which is causing it to look darker. But if I had a lighter lip, I think it would be good, right? So this is what it is. I'm gonna go put on my watch. I'm not gonna wear any necklaces today because what's the point? Um, and then yeah, let me show you guys quickly what I'm wearing though, okay? Let me zoom all the way out for you guys. Hey, <laughs> I got on my hoodie, my sweater dress, quote unquote hoodie. This thing is ridiculous. Okay, white um, biker shorts. <laughs> white biker shorts, and then I'm just wearing my Nikes, my white Nikes, and that's it. I'm gonna put on my watch. Um, I think, I don't know what purse I'm gonna carry. I think I'm just gonna carry my black fanny pack and just keep it around my torso area. But yeah, this is what it is. Like I said, I got this sweater from H&M. Um, so yeah, but this is a full look, you guys. I just feel like this bun ain't hidden it, you know? So let me know what you guys think. All right, guys, so I am back. Sorry about the lighting. It's a little bit late. It's about 11 o'clock. Um, and this is what my face looks like. Okay, 11 o'clock at night. This is what my face looks like. I'm tired. Um, I've had a little bit of more of one, two drinks to drink. Let me start over. Okay, have a ring light on just to try to capture as much um, light. I'm very, very tired, you guys. I've had way too much to drink. It was kind of a cool night. I'll leave um, the temperature on the screen so you guys know the temperatures that I was dealing with. I was on the patio all night, um, and this is what it looks like. So still very matte, you know? It's kind of getting a little bit moisture on my nose, a little bit, but aside from that, fine. All right, this is what it is. All right guys, so I came to my bathroom just to show you guys. But this foundation is very beautiful. Like, I don't even want to take it off. How nice it looks. Like, it looks so nice. It looks so flawless. So nice, honestly. I finished my makeup at about 5.30. So I've had my makeup on since about maybe like 5 o'clock. So since 5 o'clock until 11, this is what my makeup is looking like. Pretty good. Like I said, a little moisture that's starting to happen around my nose, which is kind of often. My forehead is still very much matte. Um, yeah, this is a really, really beautiful foundation. I don't know if the color matched me properly. I still feel like it's a little bit red for me. I'm gonna have to look back at the footage and kind of get a full overview, but nothing that I clearly cannot work with, right? Nothing that I can't work with at all, but this is the foundation, you guys, absolutely beautiful. So once again, my shade that I got was in Macau, um, medium deep four. So if you guys know of a shade that's a little bit more yellow undertone, let me know. Um, but I don't know if I'm going to purchase this foundation, you guys, just because I don't want to just have foundation and I'm not using it. And it's not like we can always go out and about to dress up and look nice and everything like that. Like we have measurements here. In Toronto, I think it was yesterday, our Prime Minister said that we're pretty much on curfew, so all the restaurants are going to be closing at 11 o'clock. Yeah, I will definitely talk to you guys later. Let me know what you guys think about this foundation, and I will see you guys later. Bye!